expect some baseball in the Cactus League this afternoon. We expect Jorge, Pol excuse me, Julio, and then there's Jorge Polanco. You got Garver. The last few years, except for the short 2020 season, right? He was a start of the spring. He's going up against the White Sox today, and so far, clouds that we had yesterday. Game rained out yesterday. It's the mayor in the berm in shorts and t-shirts. You join us later tonight for an exciting NHL matchup. That's right, your Seattle Kraken. Please Castillo, first pitch. And it's a first ace of a very, very good team. Field pulled around to the right. Up and in. Sims, White Flowers with you. And Wade Black. They also made the right call. And it feel looked to me like it was the deal. <laughs> Here's a 2-1. I think 150 in on the spring is... Just in his ninth year, really liking this nudie and how things are working out. 37 and 37. 21, 22, 27. On first Horton, you look at the division, you look at Texas, you look with Castillo here this afternoon. No homers, two RBI. That's a cooking jump at 87. Be aggressive. That's good advice. Always working the edges. Got 0 1. 2 2, runner goes. Yeah. Look. Aaron. On 12 pitches in his entry quarter now. Reporting. P95 for me, Dave, or finish it. And he hit me on the back. Walked up. And mine zone. It's double play ball. Lovely turd. Manager is too, but this right here is going to help Castillo out. It's right to the right guy. But I would think coming down that last get out of here alive. Spring was with the Mets last year, 2 nights. Right. Good hard stuff. Towards the left, there's a bit of swing and a miss one. Great to see JP Crawford lead off. Get the merit of batting order, and I think we're going to get used to seeing a full addition. He has been already this spring. It's Jake Woodford. White Sox signed him in four years back in November. Here's JP from our campaign last season. JP from last year. In He went back to drive line again this winter. Stretch two on. Slam extra bases for JP. For the devil to get things going for the. Well, JP Crawford started out. Down here this weekend. Sight to see. Here's first pitch. X. Off the end of the bat. Got full. Throw over to third. And they got JP. Worked out well for the. JP thought he was going to get past it. Turn around quickly to get him at third. Blancos look good. Two homers, eight RBI. Julio, not much believe. It's formation up the middle. It's going to be a good one. So guys talk about his work ethic. Breaking ball. Started off in the strike zone. Dropped right at the bottom. Runner goes. Got a good break. Here's back up the full speed. Got a little tangled. It. Runs going to wave it. And he's going to make it. on the board. It's Polanco with a big drive to right side. It's his ninth RBI. Bring. Nine RBIs to Dave Mitchell. Julio wasn't sure if he was going to catch it or not. Get him in. Second baseman in it. Well, it's 6-4-2 from coaching at third. Sight to see. Expect some baseball in the Cactus League this afternoon. We expect Jorge, Pol excuse me, Julio, and then there's Jorge Polanco. You got Garver. The last few years, except for the short 2020 season, right? He was at the start of the spring. He's going up against the White Sox today. And so far, clouds that we had yesterday. Game rained out yesterday. It's the mayor in the berm in shorts and T-shirts. You join us later tonight for an exciting NHL matchup. That's right, your Seattle Kraken. Please catch the first pitch. And it's a first ace of a very, very good team. Field pulled around to the right. Up and in. Sims, White Flowers with you. And Wade Black. They also made the right call. And the field looked to me like it was field. <laughs> Here's a 2 1. So, yeah. I think 150 in on the spring is. Just in his ninth year, really liking this nudie and how things are working out. 37 and 37. 21, 22, 27. On first Horton, you look at the division, you look at Texas, you look with Castillo here this afternoon. No homers, two RBI. That's a cooking jump at 87. Be aggressive. That's good advice. Always working the edges. Got 0 1. 2 2, runner goes. Look. Aaron. On 12 pitches in his entry quarter now. Reporting. P95 for me, Dave, or finish it. And he hit me on the back. Walked up. In my zone, it's double play ball. Nicely turned. Manager is too, but this right here is going to help Castillo out. It's right to the right guy. 
But I would think coming out of that last get out of here alive spring was with the Mets last year two nights Good hard stuff Towards the left there's been swaying in this one We're gonna see JP Crawford lead off Get the Mariner batting order and I think we're gonna get used to seeing full addition He has been already this spring Jake Woodford White Sox signed him in four years back in November. Here's J.P. from our campaign last season. J.P. from last year in... He went back to drive line again this winter. Stretch two on. Slam extra bases for J.P. And the devil to get things going for the... So J.P. Crawford started out. Down here this weekend. Right to see. Here's first pitch. X. Off the end of the back. Got full throw over to third. They got J.P. Worked out well for the JP thought he was going to get past it. Turn around quickly to get him at third. Blancos look good. Two homers, eight RBI. Julio, not much believe. It's formation up the middle. It's going to be a good one. Two guys talking about his work ethic. Breaking ball. Started off in the strike zone, dropped right at the bottom. There it goes. Got a good break. Here's back up the full speed. Got a little tangled. It's going to wave it. And he's got a Mariners on the board. It's Polanco with a big drive to right. It's his ninth hour bring. Nine RBIs to Dave Mitchell. Was Julio wasn't sure if he was going to catch it or not. Get him in. Second baseman in it. Well, it's 6-4-2 from coaching at third. Sight to see. Come Back. Some baseball in the Cactus League this afternoon. We expect Jorge, Pol excuse me, Julio, and then there's Jorge Polanco. You got Garver. The last few years, except for the short 2020 season, Brad, he was a start of the spring. He's going up against the White Sox today, and so far, clouds that we had yesterday. Game rained out yesterday. It's the mayor in the berm in shorts and t shirts. If you join us later tonight for an exciting NHL matchup, that's right, your Seattle Kraken. Please Castillo, first pitch. And it's first ace of a very, very good team. He'll pull around to the right. Up and in. Sims, White Flowers with you. And wait, but they also made the right call. And the field looked to me like it was the field. <laughs> Here's a 2-1. So, you know, hitting 150 in on the spring is... Just in his ninth year, really liking this nudity and how things are working out. 37 and 37, 21, 22, 27. On first Horton, you look at the division, you look at Texas, you look with Castillo here this afternoon. No oh, homers, two RBI. That's a cooking jump at 87. Be aggressive. That's good advice. Always working the edges. Got 0 1. 2 2, runner goes. Yeah. Look. Aaron. Yeah, right. 12 pitches in his entry quarter now. Reporting. P95 for me, Dave, or finish it. And he hit me on the back. Walked up. And mine zone. It's double play ball. Nice. Lovely turd. Manager is too, but this right here is going to help Castillo out. It's right to the right guy. But I would think coming out of that last get out of here alive spring. It's with the Mets last year, two nights. Hi. Hi. Good hard stuff. Towards the left, there's been swaying in this one. We're going to see J.P. Crawford lead off. Get the Mariner batting order, and I think we're going to get used to seeing full addition. He has been already this spring. It's Jake Woodford. White Sox signed him in four years back in November. Here's J.P. from our campaign last season. J.P. from last year in. He went back to drive line again this winter. Stretch two on. Slam extra bases for J.P. And the devil to get things going for the. So J.P. Crawford started out. Down here this weekend. Right to see. Here's first pitch. X. Off the end of the back. Got full. Throw over to third. And they got JP. Worked out well for the score. JP thought he was going to get past it. Turn around quickly to get him at third. Blancos look good. Two homers, eight RBI. Julio, not much believe. It's formation up the middle. It's going to be a good one. Two guys talking about his work ethic. Breaking ball. He Started off in the strike zone, dropped right at the bottom. There it goes, got a good break. Here's back up the full speed, got a little tangled. It's going to wave it, and he's going to make it on the board. It's Polanco with a big drive to right side. It's his ninth hour bring. Nine RBIs to Dave Mitchell. Was Julio wasn't sure if he was going to catch it or not. Get him in. Second baseman in it.
Well, it's 6-4-2 from coaching at third. Sight to see. 